Trump University a couple years ago, but she suddenly dropped the whole thing, and Donald Trump made a sizable donation to her re-election campaign. Other states later exposed Trump University as a fraud, even as Bondi was seemingly committing fraud of her own. Now she's back at the center of Trump's scandals. PAM Bondi is no longer the Attorney General of Florida. There were rumors flying late last year that Donald Trump would appoint her to a high ranking position in his administration. That didn't end up happening and Bondi instead took a job at a lobbying firm. We figured that would be the end of the story because lobbyists tend to keep out of the public eye while doing their wheeling and dealing. But that just changed big time. Alva Johnson just filed a lawsuit asserting that, while she was working for the Trump 2016 campaign, Donald Trump tried to kiss her on the mouth without consent. This storyline will play out with depositions and court filings, and we'll surely learn more details as we go. But for now, one of the two key witnesses in the story is, of all people, Pam Bondi. Alva Johnson says that Pam Bondi was standing there at the time and witnessed the whole thing. But Bondi is telling the Washington Post that while she was witness to the situation, no such attempted kiss took place. The thing is, Pam Bondi is a consistent liar who has frequently lied on Donald Trump's behalf while acting as a campaign surrogate and who has taken an apparent bribe from Trump in the past. So she won't get much legal traction as a witness. Perhaps more importantly, if she lies TP protect Trump during the Alva Johnson depositions and it can be proven that she's lying, she'll be on the hook for perjury. Will Bondi finally face justice?